So to be holy means to be set apart. And now God, because of his holiness, is set apart from the power, the practice, and the presence of sin, and is set apart to absolute righteousness and goodness. In other words, there is no sin in God. And God can have nothing to do with sin. If we are to approach God, we must do so on God's terms, not ours. As a result of this, somehow we must be holy. After all, God is holy. Any holiness which falls short of God's holiness will not be able to stand in the presence of God. Therefore, because of the holiness of God, we must have a new life in which our sins have been forgiven and done away with so that we can actually be separated from sin as God is. So this is the good news of the gospel, that Jesus Christ died for our sins, having taken them upon himself and have set us apart from our sins. Amen.